everyone. It's uh, just a very short video to give you a tip on how to configure uh, your workspace with Zoom and the, white the whiteboard so you can work in the best way possible during the workshop. So right now I am in a deep conversation with, uh, with my cat, whose name is Pukis, and we are on Zoom, as you can see. Um, and if you want to have that layout in Zoom, it's, uh, it's very simple. You just go top right and you put gallery view. If you put speaker view, you see only the active speaker, but what you want is actually the gallery view so you can see all the participants to the conversation. Okay, um, but you will see that quite fast, you will face an issue is that when I'm asking you to work on Miro, so if I'm showing you Miro, it's uh, on Miro, uh, so the, the virtual whiteboard on the second screen, then you don't see me anymore, right? Because I'm just here with Pukis uh, on, uh, on the Zoom. So what you want to do actually is simply to reduce the size of the zoom window. So it's very simple. You just go here and you reduce the size horizontally like that. You can also remove the chat if you want. Cat left, he left my workshop. So reduce the size, okay? And now you just move that to to the to the second screen, like like, like to the to the whiteboard basically. So I take that and I move it right here, okay? And you can see that doing that way, I can also reduce the size of the, of the whiteboard. Yeah, there we go. Uh, and you can see the participants on the left, left side of the screen, which is great. You can see everyone. You can, of course, increase or decrease the size if you need. Yeah, and we have the whiteboard where we're going to work. Uh, on the on the right hand of the screen and really if you have a small screen that's the best way to do so because you can see everyone in the zoom and you also have a nice uh, I would say one third is the people you are chatting with so the zoom and two third is the virtual wh whiteboard and that way you can really you know you can uh, work on the whiteboard add some content on the stickies and everything while seeing the people and that's the that's that's the best way to do if you are lucky enough to have two screens, then it's way more simple. You just open uh, open the, the Zoom, you make sure you're on gallery, gallery view, and then I'm just moving to the two screen view so you can see, I put the Zoom on one screen, and then I have the mirror on the second screen with the whiteboard where I can work. And that's really the best, the best possible setup uh, you can have if you have the ability to connect two screens to your computer. Uh, that's it. Uh, I hope uh, it's going to be useful to you. And we are, of course, uh, always, uh, always here to, to answer all your technical questions about your setup. And yeah, have a great workshop. Cheers.